next. Once you have the basic notion of a stance and you're able to move around, the next thing is you need to be able to lower your level and quite related to that you need to be able to cut the distance or travel the distance between where you are and where your opponent is. There are several ways to do this. We'll be doing some setups in a little bit, but first we're just going to go over the basic technique of lowering your level and being able to cut the distance. Of course, when we attack, we want to set that attack up, but for now we're just going to be doing the basic part of it, which is lowering the level and cutting the distance. Lowering your level. A couple of points that's are, that are very, very important. One, you need to lower your level with your legs and hips and not your head. A mistake many people make when they're learning to wrestle is they have a tendency to have their head lower while their hips stay pretty much stable and at the same level. What you need to do is lower your level with your legs and your hips, not your head. The angle of your back should remain about the same throughout that entire movement. When I lower my level, I don't want to be changing the angle of my back where it was. I simply, if this is my stance and I lower my level, the angle should be roughly the same here. That's very, very important. It's important that you lower your level with your hips. You need to get your hips low to be able to be successful in your attacking maneuvers. Now, there are three variations I want to go over. The first one is simply to learn how to lower your level. Okay, this is more of a close range type of attack. And we'll be talking about a longer range attack in a moment. But the first important, uh, the first important skill to be learned is simply to be able to drop your level quickly. What we're going to do is we're going to get in our wrestling stance here and first step is simply to lower your level. When I lower my level, my level just drops straight down. I don't lift, I don't start by bringing momentum up to come down. When I lower my level, I just want to come down. I just want to lower my level. Okay, that's very, very important. I'm just going to lower my level. Just come down. You'll notice my rear heel is up. My weight is slightly forward. I'm not back here where I'm feeling I'm going to fall back. My weight is slightly forward because I'm going to be traveling in that direction in a moment. Repeating, I drop my level, my rear heel, heel is up, my hands are in front of me, my head is up. I'd still be directing my visual attention towards my partner, towards my opponent. From here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to move forward with my weight such that the front knee goes down. Next, what I'm going to do is I've got to catch up with my rear foot to be able to get a, a good frame or base after I attack, perhaps in a double leg. Repeating, the first skill is simply to lower your level. You're going to lower your level by getting in your wrestling stance, moving around for a moment, then dropping. From here, you'll notice my rear foot is up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to move forward immediately after coming down. My front knee comes down. My rear leg catches up. From here, I'm going to drive into my opponent. We're not going to deal with that though right now. 